I'm a doctor, not a mind reader. I'm assuming command of this vessel. Woohoo! Are you out of your Vulcan mind? Guys, I'm not even gonna try to hide how excited I am. We are watching Wrath of Khan from 1982. Let's get to it. We're watching Wrath of Khan. I have been watching lots of Star Trek stuff. Check out my top 10 episodes of Star Trek the original series if you missed it. Yes, I did watch Space Seed, so I know about Khan. And he's a great villain and I'm excited to see him back. They stranded him on a planet and who knows what happened. The music is by James Horner. I heard. But he's great. I've done lots of James Horner on this channel. Wrath of Khan! Great title, man. If I was a villain, my movie would be called Wrath of Jen. 100%, that's a great title. I mean, a movie is only as good as its villain sometimes, you know? I enjoyed Star Trek The Motion Picture a lot. I also watched six bonus episodes, Star Trek The Original Series, on my Patreon. So leave me a comment if you want to see those come to YouTube. I'm happy to do that too. And we are going to be starting Star Trek The Next Generation on my Patreon after I finish these movies. In the 23rd century. Captain's log, stardate Captain's log. 8130, approaching neutral zone. All systems normal. Stand Who's by. this? Project parabolic course to avoid entering neutral zone. Captain, I'm getting something on the Bruh. distress channel. We have struck a gravitic mine and have lost all power. Hey, their uniforms look really spiffy. Better than the last ones. Data on Kobayashi Maru. Kobayashi Maru. Plot and intercept course. What the heck is going on? Where's Kirk? Warning, we have entered neutral zone. We are now in violation of treaty, Cassidy. You're not supposed to go in the neutral zone. I've lost their signal. Is, it a, is this a trap? Inform the Klingons we are on a rescue mission. They're jamming all the frequencies. Klingon. Torpedoes activated. Battle stations, activate shield. Battle stations? Freaking Klingons! Evasive action. Evasive maneuvers. <laughs> oh, what? How, how did that happen? Prepare to return fire. Ah, is he all right? Shield's collapsing, Captain. Fire all phasers. No power to the weapons, Captain. Spark! Um, is this a dream? Everyone's hurt. What's going on? Send out the log boy. All hands abandoned ship. All my guys are down. Was this just a test? Lights. More There's our Kirk. Very realistic simulator. Well, I'd want to be trained by Kirk. Is that all you gotta say? Very I'm good. I don't believe this was a fair test. There was no way to win. They just want to see how she acts under pressure. How we deal with death is at least as important as how we deal with life, wouldn't you say? Aren't you dead? <laughs> I assume you're loitering around here to learn what efficiency rating I plan to give your cadets. As I recall, you took the test three times yourself. Oh, really? Yeah, Kobayashi Maru, was that the Star Trek 2009 movie? It sounded familiar. It was the best of times. It was the worst of times. What Happy is that, birthday. Dickens? Where are you off to now? The Enterprise. And you. Home. Oh, I literally never thought about where Kirk is from. They must have told me before, but he's a human. Does that mean he's from Earth? Beware Romulans bearing gifts. <laughs> Romulan ale. Oh. Why, Bones, you know this is illegal. You open this one. Klingon aphrodisiacs? No. Ooh la la. Cheers. Cheers, boys. Good, no good? Ah. Damn it, Jim, what the f is the matter with Damn you? Damn it, Jim. Uh, I'm a doctor, not a mind reader. Is he depressed? This is not about age. He wants to be back on the Enterprise. You're a Heidi. Don't mince words, Bones. What do you really think? Get back your command before you turn into part of this collection. Yeah, man, fly while you still can. I mean, yeah, we need to get our crew back on the Enterprise. For real. That's where they belong. Stardate 8130.4. This checkoff? Follow checkoff. Mm. It's in connection with Project Genesis. Continuing our search for a lifeless planet. Does it have to be completely lifeless? Don't tell me you found something. It could be a particle of pre-animate matter caught in the Matrix. Ooh, the Matrix. Maybe it's something we can transplant. Something you can transplant? There can't be so much as a microbe or the show's off. Well, don't have kittens. Genesis is going to work. Teaming up with me for bridge after dinner? Maybe. We are dealing with something that could be perverted into a dreadful weapon. What is this Genesis? Yes, Energize. All right, Project Genesis, they need a tester planet. This is the garden spot to see the Alpha 6. There's nothing here. Except maybe Khan. I mean, we know he's going to be back. Look at this. It's like the Martian. Those look like cargo carriers. Oh, maybe it is gone. Oh, my goodness. 
If it is Khan, presumably, he's been like stranded on a desolate planet with only a few other people with him. Maybe he's gone really crazy. This is kind of like alien. And where's the rest of the ship? Looks like no one's been there for a while. Is there? Something creepy gonna pop out. Moby Dick. Botany Bay. Got to get out of here now. Maybe it's already too late. Oh, creepy, I gotta chill. They're all waiting. Oh, crap. Captain Terrell, respond, please. Now they'll need a new captain. Reveal. Reveal. <gasps> God! I gotta chill, he's such a good villain. What a cool idea to take a villain from the show and expand it. This. Dun I don't know you. I never forget a face. Jackal. Good memory. Sir, I demand of you. You are in a position to demand nothing. He's so calm. I love a calm villain. He is all that remains of the ship's company and crew of the Botany Bay. Are you men and women, you have a cat and cat. <laughs> These people had sworn to live and die at my command. Is that lady still with them? The woman that went with them from the ship? The Enterprise picked up the Botany Bay, lost in space, sent 70 of us into exile on this barren sand heap. And City Alpha 5, there was life! This is City Alpha 5! City Alpha 6 exploded, drifted the orbit of this planet, and everything was laid waste. My genetically engineered intellect allowed us to survive. Oh yeah, he's like superhuman. He's very strong. Super smart. Yeah, yeah, right, 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 right. I was a prince. You didn't expect to find me. Why are you here? <gasps> Just picks him up super strong. Why? Oh, please don't be curry being gross. <laughs> oh, jeez. We killed 20 of my people, including my beloved wife. It's like an armadillo, but like super scary. Ew! They're young. Enter through the ears. Uh, oh my god, they put like a thing in the ear and it go- uh. Follows madness. <laughs> I'd be sweating. <gasps> no, don't. These are pets, of course. Oh, oh no, 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 no. Captain Kirk was only doing his duty. They can't kill these guys off! Ah! Oh my god, gross. Oh my god, gross. Done. Why are you here? Can he steal their ship? This is Admiral Kirk's party on final approach. <laughs> their uniforms look really good. I like these ones. This musical theme's using a lot more of the original series theme, I think. Whoa, whoa, cool. I think you know my trainee crew. Certainly they have come to know you. Mr. Scott, you old space dog. You're welcome. <laughs> he is an old space dog. And who do we Love have Scotty. here? Scotty. Midshipman first class, Peter Preston. I'll see you on the bridge, Admiral. Yeah, yeah, she's a, she's a Vulcan. This is quite an inspection. Look at Scotty. Take a look around, sir. She's optimal. Look at our Enterprise. I've said it before, I'll say it again. The Enterprise is as much a character on this show as anything else. Let's do it. Enterprise is clear for departure. Yes, this is what I want to see. Stage, flux Kirk on the bridge. Space oh, look at service. him. Just surveying his land. Have you ever piloted a starship out of space, Doc? Ba -da 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 -da. Take her out, Mr. Savick. For everything, there is a first time, Lieutenant. Would you like to tranquilize me? Hit one quarter and full <laughs> power. <laughs> Ooh, this would be so fun to play. Woo! Was this movie a big hit when it came out? I'm curious. Course heading, Captain. City Alpha Captain's 5. Alright, meanwhile, Project Genesis. What about do it? I'll be coming in on Hyper Channel. It's the Starship Reliant. This is USS Reliant. Is he gonna, like, say whatever Khan wants him to say, though? Has something happened? Nothing has happened. Lying! All materials of Project Genesis will be transferred to this ship. This is completely irregular. The order comes from Admiral James T. Kirk. He's lying! I have no intention of allowing Reliant access to our worker materials. 
Please prepare to deliver Genesis to us upon our arrival. Look at him, he's just standing there. They will attempt to contact Admiral Kirk <laughs> and confirm the order. Are you wearing your hair differently? Oh, he thinks she's it's still pretty. regulation, Admiral. You're bothered. Is there chemistry there? May I ask how you dealt with the test? You may ask. <laughs> Vulcan. Who's been holding up the damn elevator? Thank you, sir. <laughs> Cranky, I love it. I have an urgent comp pick from Space Lab Regular One for you, sir. I'll take it to my quarters, Uhura. Why are you taking Genesis away from us? I wonder if he'll know it's Khan right away. Probably not. Did you give the order? What order? Who's taking Genesis? Genesis. Uhura, what's happening? Uhura, comms, get on it. Jammed at the source. Alert Starfleet headquarters. I just watched Spaceball and I I'm thinking of jam. They waited until everyone was on leave to do this. Scientists have always been pawns of the military. Yeah, look at this, like, shot all around. What about Reliant? Cool. She's on her way. With Khan aboard. Oh boy. I want to see him and Kirk come face to face. Meditating. Something may be wrong in regular one. We've been ordered to investigate. I told Starfleet Command all we had was a boatload of children. Petty children. The ship is yours. No, that won't be necessary. If we are to go on actual duty... He wants him to be the captain. I have no ego to bruise. Commanding a starship is your first best destiny. I agree. I would not presume to debate you. That is wise. <laughs> you are dumber than me. <laughs> the needs of the many outweigh, outweigh the, the needs, needs of, of the, the few. few. Or the one. They're both quite wise now. Look on speakers. Captain Kirk on the bridge. I'm assuming command of this vessel. Woohoo! Duty officer so open the ship's log. We'll be going to warp speed. To warp! Everything is as it should be. Ready, sir. I'm going to have to ask you to grow up a little bit sooner than you expected. So much for the little trading crews. But they're all secretly happy to be going back into it. Course to intercept Enterprise. Ready, sir. Meanwhile... We're all with you, sir. Captain Khan. We have a ship and the means to go where we will. No, that's true. He doesn't want to go do a revenge mission. You do not need to defeat him again. Yeah, they could just drive off. He tasks me and I shall have him. Prepare to alter course. There's no response from regular one. But no longer jammed. They're unable to respond. They're unwilling to respond. Maybe Spock can just figure it out. Give up Genesis, she said. Have Dr. McCoy join us in my quarters. Mm -hmm. Now, will someone please tell me what's going on? So grumpy. Access to Project Genesis summary. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Security scan approved. Positive ID. Summary, please. Genesis is life from lifelessness. Matter is reorganized with life generating results. I mean, maybe this is how humans once were seeded onto the earth. It literally is Genesis. Mm -hmm. What if this thing we use where life already exists destroys such lives? Do you have any idea what you're saying? It has always been easier to destroy. The earth was created in six days. We'll do it for you in six minutes. He's mad about it. They're so different, those two. He's all passion. He's all logic. Kirk's somewhere in the middle. That's why they're a good, tri a good trio. Indicate a vessel in our area. It's, it's reliant. 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 It's con, it's con, it's con. When are they gonna realize it's con? Oh my god. Picture Mr. Savick. Ooh, cool drum sounds. Da -da -da -da. Slow to one half impulse power. Reliant in our section. Oh this boy. And slow. When communications have not been established. Lieutenant. When communications have not been established, what? Don't fire. They're requesting communication, sir. Look at Khan. Revenge is a dish that is best served cold. <laughs> Good villain theme. Come on, Kirk. Kirk's a gut guy. Follow your gut. This is damn peculiar. Maybe you can figure it out. They say their chamber's coil is overloading their comm system. Their coil emissions are normal. They're lying! Fire! Oh, crap! He just fired on the Enterprise. That son of a bee! Well, they must know at least it's been hijacked. I don't think he's gonna suspect Khan at all. Oh god, it's chaos. I like this percussion sound. It sounds like they're banging a wrench onto a pipe. Come on, you can fix it, Scotty. They knew exactly where to hit us. Zulu, divert all power to phasers. Too late. Too late. Brace for impact. <gasps> It hit the bridge. What's left? Shut the battery. Oh my god, the I Enterprise. Can, can you give me phaser power? A few shots, son. Wishes to discuss terms of our surrender. Here we go, here we go, face to face. I have a chill. Woo! Kirk is gonna lose it. I feel like I've been waiting 15 years to see this. Oh god, here we go. God. You still remember. Face to face! 
Lawrence. What is the meaning of this attack? I mean to avenge myself upon you, Admiral. I wanted you to know first who it was who had beaten you. He needs him to know that it's him. I'll have myself beamed aboard. He would, he would. Spare my crew. Hand over to me all data regarding the Project Genesis. I give you 60 seconds. Just wants to start over a new planet and rule over it. At least we know he doesn't have Genesis. Punch up the data charts of Reliance Command Console. Seems like he has a plan. Kirk always has a plan. He's he's a good captain because he can think on his feet, he can adapt, and his gut always knows what's up. The bridge is smashed, the computer's inoperative. Damn. Needs the glasses! Oh my god, cute. Each ship has its own combination code to prevent an enemy from doing what we're attempting. To order Reliant. To lower her shield. How do we know you'll keep your word? In my judgment, you simply have no alternative. He's so smug. Stand by to receive our transmission. And our torpedo. Now, Mr. Smart. I feel like Khan is very Sir, smart, though. Our shields are dropping. Where's the override? The override! Fire, 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 fire! Oh, whoa, whoa! They've damaged the photon control and the warp drop! <laughs> Oh, this music. You go right on quoting regulations. <gasps> Who is it? Oh, jeez. Oh, it's God. He looks worried. He's alive. Whew. Is the word given, Admiral? The word is given. Warp speed. <sighs> is he dead now? Engine room reports auxiliary power restored. I'm sorry, Scotty. This is the Starship Enterprise. Please come in. Space Station Regular One, do you read? Is it empty? Are they gone? Did Khan get there? Maybe they took all the Genesis stuff and left because they didn't want anyone to, to take it. Sensors are still inoperative. A way to ascertain what's inside the station. What do you make of that planetoid beyond? Essentially a great rock in space. And Reliant could be <laughs> hiding behind that rock. Do you have enough power for transporters? They gonna beam? Barely, sir. Can you spare someone? There may be people hurt. Yeah, I can spare me. No flag officer shall beam into a hazardous area without armed mm -hmm. escort. She wants to go? All right, join the party. Jim. Be careful. It's worried we about will. him. <laughs> True, he didn't say a word to Bones. Bones is so grumpy and I love it so much. <laughs> Energize. Ooh, cool beaming suits. Ooh. Creepy music. Oh, the piano. Is Khan on there? Synthostasis. Oh, this brass. Ooh, this music's giving me chills. A rat? Space rat. Ah! Ah! <gasps> oh my god, they're all dead. Admiral, over here. Well, yeah, when all else fails, just punch it. Does he still have a bug in his ear, though? We found him on City Alpha 5. Where's Dr. Marcus? Where are the Genesis materials? None of them would tell him anything. Please, slip. Their throats. He had to get back to the Reliant in time to blow you to bits. This is creepy. He blames you for the death of his wife. I know what he blames me for. Did they still have the bugs in their ear? Did he make it down here? It was not my impression. The unit's been left on. Nobody remained to turn it off. These coordinates are deep inside Regula, a planetoid we know to be lifeless. Or is it? The Captain Spock, damage report. We won't have main power for six days. Auxiliary power. Are they listening? You can't even beam us back? Oh, no. Not at present. If you don't hear from us within one hour, alert Starfleet Command as soon as you're out of jamming range. They always get stuck everywhere. Where are we going? Where they went. All right, energize. Ooh, this looks good. This seems like a risky plan. All right, this is the underground then? He's like, see, we're fine. Genesis, I presume. Ah. Uh. Oh, oh god. Guys, they're the good guys. Oh, they don't know that though. Jim! That's right. He killed everybody we left behind. No, he did not. Please. Don't move. Yeah, I was like, we can't trust them, right? They still have the creatures in them. Your Excellency, have you been listening? Yeah, I knew it. I knew it. I knew it. I knew it. I mean, I love Chuck off, but he's not himself right now. Yet. You have the coordinates to beam up Genesis. Kill Admiral Karak. No, 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 no. How much can they resist these things? I try to obey, but kill him. And then he gets killed himself? Does he go mad? Bones, can you fix him? Ew! Jesus. Oh, oh no. 
You're gonna have to do your own dirty work now. Do you hear me? Mano a uh, mano. Are you still alive, my old friend? Perhaps I no longer need to try, Oh no, the joy can't take it. They just beamed it. Khan, you've got Genesis. But you don't have me. I've done far worse than kill you. Did you strand him there? I shall leave you as you left me. And it's kind of fair from his perspective. Very the line. Gone! This is Lieutenant Savick calling Enterprise. Can you read us? It's no use, Admiral. Who is Khan? I don't know about anybody else, but I'm starved. There's food in the Genesis cave. Enough to last a lifetime. David. He is looking at him. Is that his son? I did what you wanted. I stayed away. Is that his son? I think it is. You had your world, and I had mine. I wanted him in mine. Kirk has a son named David. They do have the same He's curly hair. like you. Please tell me what you're feeling. There's a man out there I haven't seen in 15 years. He's trying to kill me. You show me a son, I'd be happy to help him. His son! Khan better not find out that's his son. Uh-oh. What am I feeling? Oh. Aw, oh, he's really feeling it in this movie. Let me show you something. Young as when the world was new. <laughs> She's just gonna get naked. <laughs> Impulse power restored. More than a match for poor Enterprise. Ooh. This is incredible. Yeah. Have you ever seen the light? Ah! Meanwhile. Where is she? The Kobayashi Maru, sir. Will you tell me what you did? I reprogrammed the simulation so it was possible to rescue the ship. Just like in the 2009 movie, right? Got a commendation for original thinking. Cheated. I don't believe in the no-win scenario. Character Spock, it's two hours. Are you ready? I don't like to lose. And he very rarely loses. You know Dr. Marcus? Why, of course. Hello, Mr. Spock. They're inoperative, low C deck. <laughs> Admiral on the bridge. Battle stations. Look alive, Admiral on the bridge. Uh oh. Uh oh. <laughs> there is the Motara Nebula at 153 Mark IV. Visual won't function and shields will be useless. The odds will be even. Da -da 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 -da. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we're gonna have a showdown with Khan now. There she is. Here we go. This score is pretty wild. It's very uh, erratic. A lot different than the than the last movie. Reliant is closing. Not for long. If they go in there, we'll lose them. Oh boy, brace for impact. That was close. One minute to nebula perimeter. Uhura, patch me in. I sir. They about to have another talk. We tried it once your way, Khan. Are you game for a rematch? Khan! I'm laughing at the superior intellect. Oh. You can have whatever you... This oh. guy, oh. his ego is going to get the better of him. Entering the Motara Nebula. The emergency lights. Oh. Raise the shield. Not functional. They are screwed. He's not going to go down without a fight, though. Just lurking. Ooh! Bow, bow. Coming up behind. Target, fire, 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 fire. Maze lock inoperative, sir. Oh no, it's all you, Sulu. They're gonna see him. Hold your course. Ba, 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 ba. And now we wait. Shit, though, they're just gonna blow him up right now. I mean, it would appear so. Everybody but Khan, super strong. I've got to take the mains off the line. That's radiation. <gasps> See, all right, the radiation. Ah, should have listened to him, man. He should have just went off, started a new colony with Genesis, and ruled over it. But oh no, he had to go and let his ego get in the way. Man, the weapons console, Mr. Checker. Checker, back in the mix. He won't break off now. This pattern indicates two-dimensional thinking. These guys can outwit him. Z minus 10,000 meters, stand by photon torpedoes. Ooh, we're like almost in silence. All right, what now, Khan? I don't even think he cares about anything except revenge. I don't think he cares about living or dying or getting anywhere and starting over. He just wants Kirk 
Dead. Torpedoes ready, sir. Fire when ready. Ta-da! Fire. Fire, fire, fire. Ooh. Oh, they're all banged up now. Ooh. He's still alive? Send to Commander Alive. Prepare to be boarded. Really? It's beaming over? Surrender your vessel. Respawn. He'll never surrender. Will he? Enterprise to Reliant. You are ordered to surrender your vessel. He's all banged up. The game's not over. Yeah, he's never gonna surrender. <laughs> oh, he's doing the Genesis. Is he about to die? Scanning an energy source on Reliant, a pattern I've never seen before. A Genesis pattern. He'll know it. It's the Genesis wave. What? Encoded four minutes. Four minutes? We'll beam aboard and stop it. I need warp speed in three minutes or we're all dead. We need it, Scotty! Come through! Scotty always comes through. I feel like this kid is gonna go over there and sacrifice himself. Bum, 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 bum. Bum, 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 bum. Are you out of your fucking mind? <laughs> You're not going in there. I'm gonna start saying that instead of the F word. Are you out of your Vulcan mind? <laughs> I'm sorry, Doctor. I have no time to discuss Vulcan this logically. Pitched him. He had to do it. Spock! Time for my mark. Two minutes, ten seconds. Good God, man! Get out of there! Good. God, man. Is he gonna be all right? It's like putting his face right in it. Ba -da -da -da. Three minutes, 30 Three seconds. Minutes. Distance from Reliant. 4,000 kilometers. They'll never make, make it, it, are we? Um, ba -dum, bum, 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 ba -dum. This piano. Oh, you can't get away from hell's heart. I stab at thee. He's so poetic. Spit my last breath at thee. Is he about to die? Go, Spock! The mains are back online. Yeah, 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 yeah. Go, Scotty. Go, boy. Oh! Woo! Looks like a firework. From hell's heart, I stab at thee. Jeez. Better get down here. Okay, yeah, what happened to Spock? Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. Cool. No! You'll flood the whole compartment! Is it Spock? Too late. It better not be Spock. They better not be talking about Spock right now. Show me a Spock that is alive, please. Spock! No. <gasps> oh, God. Don't grieve him. Admiral, it's logical. He's not gonna die. He's not gonna die. I never took it. He would have passed it. What do you think of my solution? No, 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 no. I have been and always shall be. Your friend? Your friend. What? What's going on? They're not going to kill him. Oh. Live long and prosper. You've got to be oh. Vulcan kidding me. Did he just die? Dave. Are we at his funeral right now? To pay final respects. Spock is my favorite character. What is happening? The sunrise of a new world. He did not feel this sacrifice a vain or empty one. I am speechless. Spock is the best. This was the most. Oh. Others? Oh, oh Scotty's playing the bagpipes. I can't believe we're just seeing Spock's funeral right now. There's like six movies. He's not in the rest of them. Wow. I don't mean to intrude. He must know. Uh, I poured myself a drink. Would you like it? You never have faced death. He's gonna tell him the truth. I am your father. Cheated death. He's already been thinking about his mortality. And patted myself on the back for my ingenuity. I was wrong about you, and I'm sorry. Is that what you came here to say? Mainly. Son. And also that I'm very proud to be your son. Oh, he knows. Oh, this is heartwarming. 
so glad he has a son. That's nice. I can't believe Spock died. Departing for SETI Alpha 5 to pick up the crew of USS Reliant. And yet I can't help wondering about the friend I leave behind. He's really not dead as long as we remember him. Uh, I mean, Frig, I'm, I don't know. Uh... Far, far better thing I do than I have ever done before. Better resting place I go to than I've ever known. I think Spock was trying to tell me. My birthday. How do you feel? Seems like he feels okay. Young. Oh, young. Wow. Finally learned the lesson his best friend was trying to teach him. Space, the final frontier. Oh, Spock. Explore strange new worlds. To, to boldly, boldly go, go where, where no, no man, man has gone. gone. Oh, gonna chill. I am shocked that he died. Okay guys, well that was A Wrath of Khan, and that was so good. I will say I had no idea Spock was gonna die in this. That really threw me off. But I mean, I know that one of the movies in this franchise is called The Search for Spock, so maybe he comes back in the future. I, I'm hoping, no spoilers, but man, yeah, that, that really hit me hard. It was really like emotional scene to see him and Kirk through the glass, and I'm wondering, is that quote, the needs of the many outweigh the needs of the few? Is that from this, is it from Star Trek or are they referencing something else? I know throughout it seemed like they were sort of using a lot of literary quotes throughout which was really cool. Obviously Khan, great villain. I'm happy he was back. I think it was so cool that they brought Khan back from the show. The music was awesome. Really different than the first movie and I really liked it. It was, it was, I don't know, I'm like simmering with the brass and the oof. Yeah, it was good. It was really, really good. I enjoyed it. This one really acknowledged how long it's been since the original series and how much older the characters are now. And I really liked that. I thought that was really cool and very thoughtful of them to kind of go into the mortality of the characters. And, and you know, it is hard to get older and, and you do have to come to terms with that. It was cool to see these characters like acknowledging their mortality. Kirk in the end saying he feels young. That really hit me. I, I liked it a lot. It, it still had a lot of the humor peppered throughout. Bones and Kirk and Spock, you know, their their little dynamic is very sweet and their friendship is very cool and there's a lot of humor there and I, I like that. It's right from the old series. I can see a lot of the show in this in this movie and I liked it. But yeah, this one was really good. I just I'm I, I did not see that Spock death coming, so that was very unexpected. I thought it was very very cool that Kirk has a son. I wonder if that plays into the future movies. But oh man, I just, our, our, my boy, our boy Spock, I can't believe it. Last words, live long and prosper. Come on, he sacrificed himself. Spock is a good dude. He's a good dude. He's a good teammate, a good friend. I hope we see him again. I really do. I'm really happy that we're watching this whole series. I'm happy that I watched some of the show before. Loved the show. I'm loving it. I'm loving Star Trek. So thank you guys so much for watching. I really appreciate it. I had a great time. I hope you had a great time too. And I will see you next time. Bye guys.